wrestling community. Just over a minute to go. Scored the points that he got by getting Pulka out of off the mat. Whereas Pulka got his point as a penalty from Tahir's passivity. So Tahir at the moment is in the lead. That's why there's a little sideways triangle or a twisty by Tahir on the scoreboard. Quick look at the scoreboard. You have to keep your eye on your opponent though. Scoreboard's not going to take you down. 30 seconds to go for Pul to go for Pulka. Needs to get something here. His coach will be telling him that. Two coaches there telling him. Scampering out of the way, Tahir. Going down. Doing it cleverly though. Low center of gravity keeps squatting down. Can he get his opponent out? Pulka. Not quite. And he's down, down on the man himself. Pulka's the one. Stops as the referee. Five seconds to go. Walker gathers his breath. He's been pushed off the mat, so it's 2 1 down. Looks as if he was trying to challenge himself, but no, the referee says he's having to go. It was where he left the mat, and he has to go back into that position. So the referee is telling him to get into the parterre position. A challenge has been requested. Coaches have one challenge. If it's an incorrect challenge, you lose a point. So we're going to see that again, whether he was pushed fully off the mat, whether he has to regain the position, the parterre position that he was in. I think this is more in hope than expectation. He was saying that he kept his knees in and then got his opponent out. I'll hear the Matt Chairman explain his decision, or rather the video referee explain their decision as soon as he's come to it. Pretty cut and dry to me. Pulka was off the mat, scampered around with his feet outside of the orange. Explanation, a challenge lost, it's a one point penalty and Pulka has to go down into the parterre, French on the ground position. He's got 5.1 seconds to get up, get out of it and score two points. He gets out of it, he's done that at least, he's got a couple of seconds, he's trying his best. Well, that was a thrilling end to the battle, but Tahir got another two-pointer and takes it 5-1. Well, this one came to life in the last five seconds. Previous bout came to life in the last 75 seconds. This was the last five. But at the end of the day, Tahir is the one praising the higher power, and he's got through 5-1 at the end of a very, very tight bout. The only real score coming in the last five seconds when Paul